Here we are showing how to do a sugar tong splint. It's called sugar tongs because you pick up a piece of sugar with the tong. And this is for a injured forearm. And it works a little better than just a basic volar splint. So you take out your SAM material. And this is the patient's injured splint and they have padding on. Their shirt is perfect padding from ski patrolling or from skiing that day. And what this is going to do is wrap around the elbow, just ask the patient to hold on to that, and then we fold that back, kind of form it into the shape of their arm, and they're broken right here, we're saying, and if it were open fracture, bone sticking out of the skin, just throw a piece of 4x4 four four on there and continue on, and let them keep their shirt on as a, as a um, <clears throat> padding, and then start wrapping. Just wrap first time in the middle usually works a little better and then come around the uh, wrist and the hand you ask them to open their hand up like that and around like so and around over the elbow and what this does is it immobilizes the elbow and the wrist so the joint above the fracture and below the fracture and if I had one more ace wrap with me I would do one more however we don't but that's going to work fine and it, you can see it immobilizes it above the fracture and below the fracture and then she can still move her fingers and that's it sugar tong splint